Please don't step any closer. Well, as an official NASA recruiter, I shall go over some facts about the moon. Oh, crap. D just, he said no. To start off, the moon is 4.5 billion years old. Oh, no. It's just like the pickled olives again. It took so long that he had to, they had to do the radial transition. And, did you know that its surface is about as big as Africa? It's true. In fact, if you try to bike around the moon... Oh no. Two radials. Wow. Also, it takes one point... <laughs> oh, wait, wait, okay. The first one's tens. <laughs> the second one's hundreds, thousands, millions. Okay. It takes one point five two four seven million seconds for light to travel to the moon from here. And if you drive a flying car, it takes 130 days. I I knew that. Well, th I'm glad he tested it with the flying car. And last but not least, people who go to the moon get rich and famous. And we all know that rich plus famous, famous. And we all know that rich and plus famous equals groupies. Yeah. Um. I. I'm moving my eyebrows right now, so, I don't know. So, that concludes my presentation. Remember, NASA welcomes any of you, especially if you're a brunette. That sounded very... <laughs> that sounded a bit sex offender-ish, but I know he hit Johnny, but man, no, that's bad. Uh, they, I'm sure they just really wanted to leave after that. Everyone was standing for hours. Huh. Anyway. For some reason, I'm yawning. Whatever. Well, what do you think? NASA probably wouldn't hire you, but I suppose it was blatant enough for this. Hmm. I do try pretty hard. Are you gonna go see if that worked? Of course. Be right back. I just want to go to his- oh, no. Back. Report. Utter failure. Oh, crap. Yes, you deserve that. Deuce. Oh, yeah, yeah. It's tennis. Uh, she deserves that face palm. Hey, don't get discouraged. I'm sure there are still things to be done. Such as... Well, oh no, please, please don't do make another dumb speech once. I mean, half your idea, some of them are good, then that down was just bad. Oh no, you're gonna go to him like this? But this is when it was devastated. We can't afford to finish the building this house, Isabel. can barely afford to pay the bills this but you can't afford the lunar trip lottery wait what but can you afford the lunar trip lottery oh uh, I, I was getting so much at the moment that i was like oh, it just interrupted oh no uh if you sell this house you sure can Is the diagnosis certain? Yes, in fact, we rarely have anyone. Did you know that NASA has excellent health care plans? It's true, for both of you and your spouse. What? Ride up on horses? <laughs> Free pony rides in space! <laughs> what? Oh, look, a wedding! Good for you! But here's a riddle. Guess where you should go for your honey moon. Oh, that that was that was a bad that was bad. That was a bad riddle. Did it, I doubt any of them worked. Oh no, the bunny. The bunny that started it all. River? Dynamic glass slippery. John, Johnny, John, John. 
What the cucumber? Phew. You know what? This just isn't working. It's more than just not working. It's ridiculous. We're freaking professionals. I didn't sign up for the job to run around yelling at him like an idiot. You didn't? Look. Maybe this lack of sleep's getting to us. Had I known that we'd be an uh, we'd be an all nighter, I would have brought coffee. I agree. You should have seen the movie I constructed earlier. What movie? Exactly. Anyway, as valuable as time is here, this just isn't going to work. Wait, this just isn't going anywhere like this. Let's take a break till morning. Hopefully, Johnny can hang on till then. Hang on, he's gonna die, man. I do have some calls to make. But he's gonna die. I don't like it. I, I still think he's gonna die. And I'm sad about that. Because I wanted to see him in his toddler stuff. Or as a very little kid the whole time. But I I must now. What if he they make him take a pill to remember something? Like the Matrix. Well, I know one was to forget, but come on. This doesn't make sense. Why did the machine have no effect? Yeah, look at that close-up pixel shot. Amazing. Johnny's registered wish to go to the moon was successfully transferred, yet... There wasn't even a trace of him wanting to go to the moon after the transfer. Unless... Unless a secondary condition for the desire was changing in the- and it was changed in the process. Only then, would the same desire produce two different outcomes, at two different points in time. There's no de denying that River played an important role through it all. If there's anything that could have caused the core to change, she would be the top suspect. But out of all things, what exactly caused it? River. Just exactly what did you do? Maybe if she was into the moon, he would get into the moon. Ah. The sun's rising. Rising. Wow, I'm slurring. It's bad. Oh, birds. Birds are always good. We don't have much time left. I wonder if Neil came up with anything. Well. I could have been using the arrow keys the whole time. I feel dumb. Oh well. Dumbness always passes. All oh, the birds flying. Bam. Ugh. You can smell that squirrel Neil ran over all the way from here now. Oh, thanks. You know, you're concerned about a guy dying and now you just care about a squirrel. John H. Wiles. If I just look through their house, I might find an answer. Oh, there he is. No, I understand that part, but... Okay, did you confirm it in his records? And why again was this information not made available to us? Or the medical doctor, for that matter. Where did you get that coffee? Shh! Are you speaking with headquarters? Yes. I'll fill you in after. Now, shh. I should talk to her. I really should have watched those two last night. They were up late. Well, it's not everyday circumstance. I suppose. 
Oh, was there something you wanted to ask? Let's go with Tommy and Sarah. Or, li let's go with Lily. You know, it's pretty unusual for someone like you to work here. With two children and all, I mean. It's not that bad, really. There's a school bus that passes through here. But how did you even end up here? Well, a few years ago, my husband passed away. What happened? He was in the army. They were the last batch to be deployed overseas. Sorry to hear. I panicked. Our savings were low and the job market was grim. Johnny saw my ad and offered me this job. I accepted with gratitude. This place was peaceful too. It helped me with my grieving. Doesn't the government issue grants to war widows to help them get back on their feet? They do, and eventually I received aid. But then, Johnny was starting to have trouble on his own. He needed my help. Tommy and Sarah liked this place too, and so we stayed. As for Johnny, he was glad as well. We're going to miss him. I think deep down, he really wanted a family. Oh, hey. Before Johnny fell unconscious, he told me that you two would probably be coming soon. He said that he probably wouldn't get the chance himself, but... He wanted me to tell you thanks for him. So, thank you. Oh, that's so sweet and sad at the same time. And once again, I'm Rakash. Hope you enjoyed the video. Please like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. Thanks for watching. Bye!